everybody. Uh, this is just me, Dan Shaver, now doing my health thing of the week. Um, just giving you my personal update first. Basically, unfortunately, this week I didn't lose anything. I'm still at 240. Um, trying to get more of a thing. Today was my last training with Aaron. So now I'm pretty much on my own. Now I am trying to be more healthy. I'm also trying to go for my certification so I can become a personal trainer as a future profession, I guess. Um, that's just an idea. I want to use that as a backup. And basically, I don't even really care. You know, but I love health. I love helping people. So, I mean, that's why I'm doing this YouTube video, too. Um, basically, the first thing I want to talk about today, mainly my main topic, was snacks. Now, I, what I did during the last five to six months, I was using, like, five or one bars, pretzels, fruits, oranges, vegetables. Um, and I did use yogurt every once. You want to go for more Greek, low-fat yogurt, and basically the fiber bars I was using. I was using Fiber One. Um, the oaks and chocolate were my 100, 140 calories, a little higher on that one, or the 90 calorie brownies and cookies. I mean, kind of just a guilty pleasure. You kind of want that chocolate. You want that thing, and those ones are actually still good for you because the fiber you take gives it a little bit of a thing. Now, that if you're trying to lose a lot of weight real quick, I wouldn't go with those. I'd stick with vegetables and fruits. Uh, I used those because I was trying to lose weight, but I wasn't trying to lose explosions out of them. Other than that, now, that's basically I'd say go with those snacks, vegetables, cookie, or not cookies, cookies, no. Um, basically anything that's really better for you, keep an eye on calorie count if you go for a massive amount. You want your snacks to be around 100 to 150 calories, um, just so that it's enough to keep your metabolism moving so you are still losing weight and keeping your muscles going. But you don't want to go overloading where you're actually eating a whole other meal. So you don't want those meal bars or something like that. Uh, mainly it's uh, also nuts are really good because you are getting a lot of um, saturated, unsaturated fats. You don't want the saturated fats because they're the ones that are actually better. Because unsaturated fats will actually keep your body working a little better, I guess. Um, other than that, that's my main topic. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. I can also, I'll try to get back to everybody who comments anything. Right now I'm not getting too many comments, so I think I'll be able to get back to all of you. Um, other than that, please keep watching. I have more topics. I will have a recipe of the day, which today is actually General Tso's. I figured I'd give it out as a, a fast food replacement. I guess it's just Chinese food. Uh, General Tso's is for men's health um, fitness guy. Um, and I found it in there. My sister's dying to make it. We didn't have the recipe, so that's why I'm putting this on here so it's easier to find. Um, I'll put the recipe in the um, comment, the section below information because I'm not going to be able to put it on the screen. I'm not that skilled at that stuff yet. And hopefully my scenery will be changing so I'll be able to revisit this with actual visual aids or full broccoli or something basically a general idea of everything so you guys can see everything so you know what to basically grab and stuff like that. Um, and I'll have a little bit more information as well. Um, also then I want to do an exercise of the day which I did look into. Um, there are tons of them. This one, I don't really have a specific one for you guys because it's actually exercise of the week today with the recipe of the week. I'm only doing it once a week. Um, mainly, I'd say keep an eye, work on, what, this is the first one. I'm going to put this one free roam. You want to use whatever you feel like you want to lose weight. If you want to lose weight in your abs or your belly, do some crunches, do some sit-ups. Keep that body part of your body straight. You don't want to end up focusing on your chest. You want to use your chest up. You want to make sure you're working on different things. I mean, like, if you work on your arms only, that's all you'll get. I mean, I've still got a lot of work to do on the midsection. And my arms are pretty much mostly muscle. So I am still taking steps in that range, too. Um, basically, what you want to do is keep an eye on certain items and keep it going. Basically, like I said, this is going to be a free roam exercise. Do whatever you feel like you can believe to do. Next week, I'll actually give an exact exercise that I'd like everybody to do. It's just an opinion. I'd be nice. I'm going to try to keep ranging it from random ones, not like sit-ups, push-ups. That's kind of like a class, and I'm not teaching a class. I'm just doing a YouTube channel that hopefully to help you if you see new exercises you wouldn't think of. Now, a lot of the exercises I'll be bringing up are for men's health, and I will be grabbing women's health too, so I can put some other stuff, stuff out there for the ladies as well, just so I have a variation. But, like I said, General Tso's chicken, only 300 calories compared to your uh, Chinese restaurant, I think 800 and 9,000. So, I mean, it's a lot better, a lot tastier. I haven't had it entirely yet, so I can't tell you if it's amazing. But most people I've heard who've had it love it. Um, it is somewhat hard to find because you got to find certain spices and stuff. So, I mean, if it's Chinese, you can find anything. You can 
in shiny gear and have fun with me. Um, like I said, otherwise, I'm in good health. I'm hoping to get in better. And everybody, keep healthy. Keep those snacks in mind. You only want to do two or three snacks a day. Most magazines will keep you up for free. Keep an eye on fiber bars. Vegetables are always good. You can even have a lot more of those without much of a problem. Nuts, yogurts, make sure you keep on low-fat yogurts. And don't overdose on peanuts because I will mean you are going to go. If you're doing salted peanuts or like caramel peanuts because you heard me say peanuts. You're like, oh, I can use chocolate covered peanuts. <laughs> you got to keep an eye on what you're eating. So keep an eye out for that, everybody. Have a good one. Be healthy. See you on Thursday.